Can you name the only treaty that achieved universal ratification in the UN? Today is World Ozone Day, celebrated on September 16 every year. But why is this day so important? The ozone layer is Earth's natural sunscreen, located 15 to 30 kilometers above us in the stratosphere. The invisible sheet absorbs 97 to 99 percent of the sun's harmful ultraviolet radiation that would otherwise reach Earth's surface. Without the ozone layer, life as we know it could not exist. UV radiation would cause massive increase in skin cancer, cataracts, damage to crops, and destruction of marine ecosystems. But here is the alarming part. In the 1970s to 80s, scientists discovered a hole in the ozone layer over Antarctica caused by chemicals called CFCs, chlorofluorocarbons, found in refrigerators, air conditioners, and aerosol sprays. Then came the Montreal Protocol, which was signed in 1987. This global agreement phased out ozone-depleting substances worldwide. The results? The ozone hole has been shrinking. Scientists predict it will fully recover by 2060 to 2070. And yes, the Montreal Protocol is signed by 197 countries, the first treaty in the history of United Nations to achieve universal ratification.